Hey, what's up, guys? So we're going to be playing some um, mesmerizing deck, and looks like he's activating an upstart goblin. Sorry it's a little late in the duel, but it's just his first turn, so it's really not that big a deal. Um, <clears throat> let's see what he does here. Let's see, what does this one do if you activate it? Trap hole. Not named Dark Trap Hole, except during the damage step, you can add a Mesmerizing Man into your turn to deck of the hand. Oh, I can activate whole normal trap cards from my hand. Um, add one normal trap hole card from my deck to my hand. F. When it's normal summon, I can add a whole trap, normal trap. Uh, deep dark trap hole. Um, I'm just gonna grab bottomless for my deck. Uh, actually, I just might want to say this. Attack. What? That's all face down. Uh oh, he's probably playing Empty Jar. He's going to let me draw a card, though. That's pretty good. <laughs> nice. Okay, so he's probably playing Empty Jar. It's an okay deck. But, yeah. Okay, so he's playing an Empty Jar Mill. Yeah, he's playing Empty Jar Mill. I do have two insect types in my hand. Uh, when this card is summoned, if you activate a trap, a whole normal trap. Kaizura? Probably should have summoned this one. But I'm going to banish. For a Doom Dozer. Burial from a different dimension. They're both insects. Now we're going to on straight for the attack. What the fuck? Effect of centipede.
Got the Hornet. Centipede effect. Then we're going to add Dragonfly to hand. And uh, we're going to overlay these two. Two little fours. We're going to add this. Battle phase. Marshmallow. Um, this card inflicts battle damage in the top card of the deck to the graveyard. Oh well, I have centipede and I have dragonfly, so it's not a bad not a bad deal. I have hornet in my grave, so. Normal sun. Dragonfly. Hornet. Dragonfly. We're going to. Oh, no targets. Uh, let's see, two level three monsters. Uh, well, let's see, let's summon Acid Golem. I think that that'll just about do it. Okay.